events like this are really meaningful to our community, um, as you can tell by the videos. And, and uh, just we really do appreciate all this. And congratulations to the other inductees. You guys had amazing careers, and, and I'm uh, you know, honored to be inducted with, uh, with this class. I'm going to go a different direction, and just it's a ton of thank yous, you guys. I mean, there are so many people that have, have touched my lives, and, and I'm hoping that I can hit a lot of them. And if I don't hit or I miss some people, I'm going to throw a big blanket over it and say thank you. Um, so bear with me on this. It's, honestly, it's just thank yous. First, I want to thank my mom and dad and my brothers and sisters. I was very fortunate to have... Uh, uh, two brothers and four sisters that were my best friends growing up, and they continue to be my best friends, um, especially my brothers Joe and Chris. I've always looked up to them and admired them, and, and I still do to this day. I thank them a ton. I thank my wonderful wife, Dawn, for all of her support and love. Uh, it's tough to be a coach's wife, and, and uh, uh, she's just an amazing person, and I'm lucky to have her in my life. Um, there's three people that really kind of stand out in my career um, that had a huge impact, more so than my family, um, or as much as my family, I should say. And the first is, is Coach Newland. He was just an amazing coach, uh, a great mentor, encouraged me to, uh, to get into coaching and stay in coaching. And I was really, really fortunate to be able to be coached by that, by that man. Uh, the next is, is Coach Barnett, who is uh, an excellent coach in his own right. Um, also a great mentor, um, always encouraged me to stay into coaching, and I really appreciated all of his wisdom over the years. And then last is uh, Dr. Calvis, who, who gave her life to water polo. She's an amazing person, probably the smartest, toughest person I've ever met in my life. And I was very fortunate to call her a friend and lucky that she was a part of my life. I'd like to also thank all the, my teammates from, from UC Irvine. I was fortunate to play with some great, great players who are actually even better friends and lucky to be uh, a part of that program. Um, also want to thank uh, Corona Del Mar High School. I had 19 great years there. Um, I wasn't going to bring up any teams. There are so many great teams there. But I think it was a class of we had 86, 87, or 88. I don't even know. They're actually right here. It was, I was very fortunate to be able to coach there for 19 years, and a lot of great student athletes there, both on the, the boys' and the girls' side. Um, I'd also like to thank Stanford University, uh, Earl Coberline, and, and Dr. Leland for hiring me. Um, really proud of the student athletes there, what they've accomplished inside the water and outside the water. It's just great to sit back and just uh, be so proud of, of what they've done and, and the amazing things that they've actually accomplished. There are three families at Stanford that really stand out for their contributions to the university and to the athletic department, and specifically men's water polo. The first is the, the Dunleavy family. They endowed the uh, head coaching position uh, the, on the men's side and on the women's side. You know, very generous and really meaningful to, to the university and to our programs. So I really appreciate them. And also the Penner family. They endowed the uh, assistant position. Um, they don't even have any kids that went to Stanford. And so it, for them to do that is, uh, is really meaningful and, and a great contribution to the university. And then the Avery family, and specifically Brian Avery. Their contributions to the university um, has been over 45 years. And, and the gifts that they give and their generosity of their time um, is just truly amazing to the, the amount of, of time, energy, and money that they give to the university, the athletic department, the aquatics program, and specifically men's water polo. Truly incredible. 45 years and still going. And I'm fortunate to, to, uh, to be able to call Brian Avery a great friend. He was just an amazing person. And then last, keeping this short, um, is my longtime assistant, uh, John Barnea. You know, he gave his heart and soul every single day when he showed up to practice. And I can't thank him enough for everything that he's done um, for the university and for men's water polo. And it's uh, you know, been an honor to work with him. But you guys, congratulations to all the other inductees. And thank you for a great lunch.